your first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. Here we go again. Another chance for scattered rain showers and a few thunderstorms possible out there today. Chances a little bit lower for us though compared to the past few days. We'll still look for those mostly cloudy skies and a few peaks of sunshine in and out of those clouds. High temperatures will be around 82 to 84 down by the beaches. 83 in Myrtle's Inlet and Myrtle Beach. 84 in Conway and Georgetown. Inland areas, you may see a little more sun, a little drier of a day, but 85 still the forecast high in Florence and Marion. 84 in Bennettsville and Lumberton. Keep an eye out for those scattered showers and thunderstorms today and almost a repeat forecast for your Thursday. The tropical moisture finally takes a little bit of a break and heads back out to sea with that front washing itself out during the day on Friday. Can't rule out a stray thunderstorm or two on Friday afternoon, but Saturday, Sunday will be nice and dry out there for the weekend. High pressure building in, making for a very nice end of the week and weekend forecast overall. Still the chance for a few showers and thunderstorms as mentioned today. Isolated on Friday before a dry weekend is on tap. But over the weekend, we're going to be watching closely. Uh, at that point, it may actually be Hurricane Isaac, but right now, Tropical Storm Isaac is heading west toward the Caribbean. Behind it, we have another strong tropical wave showing potential for development. Could even see uh, it. The, the we're going to have to do this after the cutting, aren't we? Maybe. Okay, I'll be quick. Let's do it. Sorry. Your first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. We're still watching for the chance of scattered showers and even a few thunderstorms possible periodically throughout the day. When you're not seeing those, though, look for mostly cloudy skies and even some peaks of sunshine in the mix with high temperatures climbing into the mid 80s inland, low to mid 80s along the Grand Strand. All in all, not a bad day. Warm, still a bit humid though, as we have that tropical moisture in place still even into the day tomorrow. As we go to your Friday, the front begins to wash out a little bit. An isolated thunderstorm or two can't be ruled out, but by the time we get into the weekend, high pressure will build in, bringing in some drier air and making for overall a very nice weekend. Rain chances down to zero. Not the case for today, tomorrow, and Friday, but certainly lower than what we have been seeing so far this week. So watch out for a few showers and thunderstorms. Over the weekend, though, we will be tracking, at this point, Tropical Storm Isaac. By then, it may be Hurricane Isaac. And even behind it, another wave potentially strengthening into Tropical Depression number 10 over the next few days. Right now, Isaac is the one on the mind, as it is forecast to head toward the Caribbean and toward the Greater Antilles, potentially interacting with the high terrain there. But the models vary pretty significantly as to where it is expected to go. A little bit of a further northern push could actually bring it close to the southeast coastline or even possibly out to sea. Further south, a little bit weaker and closer toward the eastern Gulf of Mexico and up the west coast of Florida. Certainly warrants watching. It all depends on that weakening ridge of high pressure that will be across the eastern seaboard and an approaching trough and cold front as we head into the beginning of next week. So Keep yourself uh, informed about what's going on with Tropical Storm Isaac and the latest thinking at CarolinaLive.com underneath the Hurricane Central page. Otherwise, your forecast looks a little bit drier, a little bit of cloud cover still out there today and tomorrow. Isolated shower or thunderstorm on Friday. Plenty of sun for the weekend with mid-80s for your highs. We'll hold those mid-80s as we head into the middle of next week with upper 80s for the inland areas. Still dealing with those rain chances today and tomorrow, but the forecast to look forward to at this point is the weekend. And we'll keep you updated on Isaac, which you can get at your website, carolinalive.com. You can also get your latest news and weather updates there as well. Have a great Wednesday.